Hello and welcome to this Trispector 1000 application video. In this video we will show you how to use the Trispector to verify that caps are in place to seal products properly. We will also show you the object trigger function that allows you to capture an image without external triggering. For this application we want to measure the cap height to prove a tight fit and the cap angle to avoid misplacement. Once the Trispector is connected to SOPAS, adapt the field of view and set the correct exposure settings. Enable the encoder using the settings as required. Then activate the object trigger to allow the device capturing images on its own. By adapting the standoff, the triggering process only starts when detecting image data above this certain area. Acquire an image of a sealed cap by dragging the object through the laser line and click on the task tab to start the configuration process. Add the shape locator tool and modify its region. Proceed with using the plane tool defining the carton base plane. The navigation cube helps by fitting the tool shape around the surface. Now apply an elliptic mask to disregard the cap. Note that the carton surface is slightly curved. Adjust the percentile to provide the tool the right references for computing the plane correctly. Select another plane detecting the cap top surface. Now the distance tool becomes the first criterion for pass or fail of the object. Select both planes as references and set the thresholds to match the application requirements. For our second criterion set the maximum angle between both planes. Test your program on several objects with changed cap positions and adjust the thresholds accordingly. Note that the system only switches to OK if both criterions show pass. The last step of the workflow is setting up the results and the interfaces. Watch tutorial 3 to see how to change these settings. When you're done configuring, save the parameters to the flash memory of the device. Now you can disconnect the PC and use the Trispector for cap verification purposes as a standalone device. In this tutorial you have learned how to use the object trigger, the distance tool and the angle tool for cap inspection applications. If you want to learn more about the Trispector 1000, check out our other tutorial videos. Thank you for watching this video.